the procedure. So this masses take the masses out from the stand. So this is called stand. This is called support. This is cylinder one, cylinder two. So I need to keep take the cap out. Take the cap out, and this is a support. So the mass of support is given to you. The mass of support is given to you, 385 gram. So this 385 gram will create the pressure. Will create the pressure it is given. So if I keep this on this, it will create some pressure. And I need to calculate the pressure by formula. And then I can say if it is both are same same, then this is 100% calibrated. Okay. So this is a support. Then this is a small piece. So the mass of the small piece is 193 gram. So this small piece, I need to keep it on this hole and this hole and this shaft so that the mass will be horizontal because gravity, it should be horizontal. It should not be like this. The gravity will not act uniformly and you should be make it horizontal. So first, first step, pump the oil up to the small hole. You can see this. Yes, if the oil is below the level, then pump oil, make sure this is closed. Make sure this wall is closed and then pump oil up to the top of the small hole. If it is more, if it is more, then release this wall and take it down. Okay, so pump the oil up to the top of the hole. Yeah, it is okay. So and uh, remove the ear. Yes. Okay. Now the oil is up to the glue or top of the hole. Then keep the piston on this cylinder. Okay. Now it is acting force and the diameter is given. We can find area. So this mass will create some pressure on the oil. Same oil will create same pressure here and the reading is shown, but this is not exact because it is not free. So I need equal opposite same pressure here and here same pressure. So I can pump this until it becomes free. It jumps. Yes, it is jumped now. Now you can see it is turning before it was not turning. Okay. So what is the meaning of this? Here the pressure, here the pressure is same. What is shown here? It is how much? 0. Point, see, two lines, outside readings. 0. 0.1, 0. 0.2, 0. 0.3, 0. 0.4, 0. 0.5. Two, uh, two lines is 0. 0.1. Okay? So you can measure 0. 0.1, 0. 0.2, 0. 0.34. Is it correct? 34. So I will write here 0. 0.34. Outer reading. And what is the mass? Mass is 0 0.385, 385 kilogram. Understand? It is a gram. So 0 0.385 kilogram. Now second reading, I will add the second mass. Now I will add this. This hole and this stud should be matched. Yes. Now again see here. It is not it is not free because not same pressure. I will pump it until it jumps. Yes, it is jumped now. Means it is same same pressure here and here. So see here turning. So what is the recorded? 0.5 bar. 0.5 bar. So what is the mass now? Can you see that? What is the mass? 0.13. No, 0 0.385 plus, plus 0 0.193. 193. Understand? Because I am adding mass. What is the pressure? 0 0.5. Okay. Now add another mass. Big piece. Small piece finish. Now big piece. 578. 578 grams. So keep it here. Okay. And now pump until it becomes free. See now. No jump. 
if you pump it more say understand if you pump it more see nothing happen it will fluctuate fluctuate and come so no problem pump it until it becomes free equal pressure and see it is turning now very nicely and what is the pressure 0.9 maybe 0.98 so third reading what is this addition 8 7 5 0.578 is it correct now second mass is 0.578 plus 578 again point 578 1.156 the total mass is this what is the pressure 0.99 or 98 understand so you increase one more mass and pump it yes go and increase shabab do keep it one more mass yes pump until jump look at here look at here pump yes up to here jump pump yes if you pump it more no problem now look at this freely rotating yes good now what is the pressure fourth mass 1.156 plus 1.578 what is the pressure 1.46 1.46 okay and now fifth mass i will put unknown i don't know okay so what is this addi uh, addition one point one point seven three four seven three four so last mass one point seven three four plus i don't know the mass okay so i will put it here so see this i don't know what is the mass of that but i will record the pressure yes i will pump until jump see it is difficult to turn see no turning i will pump it until it jump yes okay now see here the equal pressure is acting okay and what is the reading 1.9 1.88 1 or 1.9 So now this pressure is too much. So don't take this mass. Release this wall and this. Yes, see now this pressure becomes zero. Close it and take all the masses out. Okay, and immediately close this because air will not go inside. Okay, and now. keep all masses on the stand and here take care of this hole some students keep like this and keep by pressure it will the stud will be damaged so keep this all masses back okay and clean the equipment last thing clean the equipment is must Okay, I will transfer the answer. And on Y axis. So, 
what is to choose on x axis and what is on y axis in fluid mechanics also i told what is in your hand what is a controlling parameter is on x axis what i calculate what i observe is on y axis so what what is in pressure calculated and mass what should i put in uh, x axis yes no x axis what i put what is in my hand i put the mass okay so it is in my hand so i will take mass on x axis m kilogram okay and what i observed what i calculated the pressure p cap p cap is on x axis write the unit also for now check your observation table i want this calculated pressure it is varying from 0.3 0 0.5 1 1.5 so scale on x axis on x axis 10 lines is equal to 0.1 bar so i will make sorry on y axis on y axis 10 lines is equal to 0.4 8 12 16 1.2 yes 0 0 8 4 4 8 12 16 and 1 0 0.2 so you should take the 1.2 yes correct thank you 1.2 1.6 2.0 okay now on x axis 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 1, 3, 0. 0.5, 1, same unit I will use. So this is 0. 0.4 bar and x axis 10 lines is equal to 0. 0.4 kilogram. Same scale I will use 0. 0.4, 0. 0.8, 1 1.2, 1.6, 1.5. Sorry, 2.0. Okay, now I will plot the reading 0 0.385 somewhere here. 0 0.385, what is the pressure? 0 0.33 somewhere, first point here. Okay, then second reading 0 0.5 and 0 0.578. So, second reading. Now, third reading. Point nine nine one point one one five six and here pressure is one point zero zero two. Now last reading, fourth reading, uh, one point seven mass is one point seven one point six one point seven one point eight one point nine and one point ten here somewhere and the pressure is one point five. 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, 1 1.5 somewhere here. I got this point as 4th reading. Okay, now I curve or straight line. How I decide? Because by relation, pressure and mass. What is the relation between pressure and mass? Mg over A. So this is a straight line equation like y is equal to mx plus c so we need to join first point and last point by a straight line but how i can find a mx from graph yes so this is i calculated 1.97 so 1.97 where is 1.97 so i will extend this line like 1.97 i will draw the horizontal line it cuts here okay then I will draw the line here and it will cut somewhere here. So this value is 1.73 plus mx is equal to this value. Write this value here or how much from the graph. Okay, so from graph, from graph at P cal is equal to 1.97, 1.97 bar, 
1.73 plus mx is equal to dash dash kilogram. This number. Okay, and then calculate mx. Mx is equal to this goes that side. You will get answer mx, and then write your conclusion. 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 How you write conclusion? What is your objective? The given pressure gauge is accurate. Given pressure gauge is having is having accuracy is having accuracy of hundred minus error. Hundred minus error. Percentage error. Percentage error, average error. So what is 100 minus percentage error? How much you got? 1.1.5485. Means I can say 98 point something accurate. 98 point something accurate. Okay. Number two. Uh, the mass of unknown object. Mass of unknown piece mass of unknown piece is equal to mx is equal to dash dash kilogram and mx is equal to dash dash kilogram from gram you can write this in conclusion from graph and from calculation and this is from calculation from calculation Understand, Shabab? So you need to plot this graph real on graph paper and then you will transfer this value here and you will get a sense.